Hey, our friends, say we're going to draw Valentine monkeys. Yeah, we're drawing two monkeys, and their tails are really long, but turning into a heart. heart. Yeah, we hope you're going to follow along. You need your drawing supplies. We're going to use markers and also some paper and something to color with. Yeah, and because we're using markers to draw and color with, we're also using marker paper to draw on. Yes. All right, you ready to start? Yep. I changed my mind. Let's first start with our pencil instead of our marker. So let's put this off to the side. And if you're already using a pencil, great. And we're going to use an eraser too. This will help us draw guidelines for our monkey's heads so that we can fit them on the paper. So let's first start over here and draw a circle. I'm going to draw it here and I'm pressing firmly or hard so that the pencil line shows up on the camera. But our art friends at home can press lightly so it's a lot easier to erase at the end. Yes. There you go. Now, if you want to, you could also draw the shape different. You could draw a little bit bigger or smaller and then erase any guidelines you don't want to keep. Now I'm going to draw the next monkey head over here. And I'm trying to draw it the same size, but also leave a little space in between. That way we can get the spacing just right on our paper before we use our marker. Oh, awesome. I love that you have two extra lines there. Which one are you going to use? Mm, I'm actually <laughs> going to draw a third line. <laughs> okay. And then I'm going to erase the outside one and the inside one. Nice. That's perfect. Let's also draw their bodies. We're going to draw really simple shapes. Let's draw two lines straight down on each circle. And then connect them at the bottom. So they look a little bit like a rectangle or a square shape for their body. Nice. And then you can also erase the extra line you're not going to keep. Let's also draw the guideline for the heart or the tails. We're going to start here. I'm going to draw a little guide point. Oh, we could even draw it a little bit lower so that we can get the two little bumps for the heart. Then we're going to start at that guide point. We're going to draw a curve that comes up, curves around, and then comes into the head. And then we can do the same thing on the other side too. Good job. Now we're ready to switch to our marker and we're going to put our pencils off to the side. And let's start by drawing the monkey's faces. We're going to start by drawing two circles. Oh, let's draw the nose first. I'm going to draw a little curve in the middle. And then we can draw two little nostrils. Then let's draw the eyes. I'm going to draw one eye right here and another eye on the other side, the same size. <laughs> then let's draw smaller circles inside for the highlight. And I'm drawing them towards the top of the eye. This makes the eyes look shiny. Yes. We can also add another reflection or highlight that's smaller just below that one. Okay, now let's color in the big circle, but leave the two little circles in each eye white. That part we sped up. So remember, if you need extra time, you can always pause the video. Okay, now let's draw the mouth. I'm going to draw a really happy monkey mouth. <laughs> <laughs> now let's draw hair on top of our monkey's head. We're going to draw a little bumpy line like this. Then we're going to come over here and let's trace over the pencil line. We're going to come down, around, underneath the mouth and chin. And then I'm going to connect into the hair on top of the head. Then we can also draw the little shape of our monkey's face. I'm going to draw a little guide point in the middle of the forehead. And then we're going to draw a bump that comes out of the guide point curves around and almost like we're connecting into the eye. Then let's come back to the guide point and draw another bump on the other side and curve into the eye. Leave a little space. Then we could draw the cheeks. We're going to come back out and then connect into the circle on both sides.
Next, let's draw the ears. I'm going to draw one ear right here and overlap the circle, the guide circle on the left, and then draw another ear the same size on the right side. <laughs> let's add another curve or letter C inside of each ear and a backwards one on this side. Next, let's switch to our erasers and erase the guidelines inside of the ear here if it's overlapping. And we can also erase the guidelines up here and around the head, anywhere you can still see the pencil line next to the marker. Now let's repeat all of those same steps for our other monkey over here on the left. So the first thing we did was the nose. I'm going to draw a little curve in the middle of the paper. And then we can draw the two nostrils. Then we can draw the eyes. Let's draw two circles. I'm going to try to match the same size over here. Then we can draw the highlights. Let's draw a circle in the top of each eye. And we can also draw that smaller circle below it. And I'm going faster just because we're repeating the same steps. So remember to pause the video for extra time. I'm going to color in the eyes too and leave those two little highlights white. Next, let's draw the hair on top of our monkey's head. I'm going to draw three bumps. And I start on the circle, but then come into the circle. And I'm also facing it this way, opposite of the other one. And then we can trace around the pencil line for the monkey's head. And remember to not draw through the ear if it's overlapping. So we're going to start up here and continue, connect into the hair. And then let's draw the mouth. I'm going to draw a big happy mouth on this one too. And we can also draw the shape of the face. So I'm going to add that guide point right in the middle. And then we can draw a curve that comes around like it's connecting into the eye and then stop. And then do the same thing on the other side. And if it's overlapping, we'll go behind the ear. We can come back out too. And then let's draw the cheeks coming out and connecting to the outside of the head. I'm going to add eyelashes to this one. <laughs> you could leave this off if you want. You could also change your drawings any way you want. I'm going to add little eyebrows on this one. <laughs> and maybe a cheek line here and also over here on this one. What are we missing? Ears. Yeah. Let's draw one ear on the left side. I'm running out of room. So I'm going to draw a little smaller. And then this one over here. We'll just draw it connecting the top of the ear, connecting to the other head. And we can draw the inside of the ear too. Now let's draw our monkey's bodies and arms. We can start here. I'm going to draw this arm inside of the body. I'm going to start here and we're going to keep it really simple. I'm going to draw, looks like the letter J. I'm not going to connect back to the body line. And over here we can draw a little arm sticking out too. Try to match the same size. And then let's draw the feet. I'm going to draw it coming down right from the corner and then back up. So the letter U. And then we'll do the same foot or leg on this side. Now let's switch to our eraser. And we're going to erase the guidelines inside of the legs. So right here, I'm going to erase. And also on this side. Oh, and we can also erase the guideline on this arm. Over here, we'll leave it because it's on the inside. Let's switch back to our marker and we can connect the head down to the leg. Then we can also connect this arm down to the leg. And then here for the bottom of the body, I'm going to draw over the pencil line, but just go a little inside each leg. Then we can draw the belly. We're going to draw the letter U. I'll start here on this arm. We'll curve around like this and then back up. And we can imagine that going behind the arm too and connecting if you have a little space there. Oh, we got to add a little belly button. <laughs> okay, now let's do the same thing over here. And we can draw the arms different. You can draw the arms any way you want. I'm going to draw this same arm coming in. And on this side, maybe I'll draw the arm 
going out instead of in like we did over here. Then I, we can draw the legs and feet on each side. And then let's erase the guidelines just like we did on the left side. We can erase inside the arms and also inside the legs. Then let's switch back to our marker and connect the arms down to the legs and also the bottom of the body to connect the legs together. And then let's draw the belly too. You can draw the letter U back up and also don't forget the belly button. <laughs> <laughs> The last thing we need to do is draw the tails. Let's start over here and we'll draw the tail on the left side. I'll trace over the pencil guideline right here. Then let's also draw another curve just like that one to match on the outside to make the tail thicker. And we can connect to the pencil line And then let's connect these two lines together with a curve like this to finish the tail. Then we could do the same thing for the other tail, except this one will drop behind the other tail. So I'm going to start on the tail, we'll curve around on top of the pencil line. And then let's draw that same curve for the outside of the tail. and then connect into the head. Then let's draw the other end of the tail, but we're drawing it behind the other one. So we'll imagine it going through, we'll come out like this, curve around, and then connect back in. We did it, we finished drawing our two monkeys with heart tails, except we're not completely done. We still need to color it. Yeah, this part will fast forward, but at the end you can pause the video if you want to match our same coloring. You could also color your drawings any way you want. You could even color your monkeys pink or purple. <laughs> now before we color it, let's switch back to our eraser and erase any guidelines that we can still see. You ready to fast forward? Yes. We did it! We finished drawing and coloring our monkeys and they turned out perfect. I especially like yours. Thank you. I love how big you drew them and I love that our two drawings don't look exactly the same. That's okay, right? Yes. Because the most important thing is to have fun and to practice. Practice. Now you can pause the video right now to match our same coloring or like we mentioned, you can color any way you want. You can even add extra things like what we did. We added more, more hearts. hearts. Yeah, more hearts and even a little shadow underneath each of the monkeys. I also used a pink colored pencil for the cheeks and a blue colored pencil on the eyes, but you can leave that off to keep the lesson a little easier. Now we use our Art for Kids Hub alcohol-based markers. If you have the same set, we use two colors for the monkeys. 103 is the dark brown, and then 25 is the face color and also the belly. Then what color did we use for the hearts? For the hearts we used 88. Yeah, that's a pink color. Then I also used 24, it's kind of an orange tan color that, for the shadow underneath the head. And then also we used WG1 for the shadow. That's a light gray. Yes. But also remember, you don't have to use our same markers. You can use any brand of markers. You could also use color pencils or even oil pastels or crayons. We hope you had a lot of fun drawing Valentine monkeys. Yes, we do. We hope you had a lot of fun and we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye. Goodbye.